how does one divide up the labor uh, when dealing with social media? Should brands deal with themselves? Should they hand it on to their agencies? Uh, who's best placed to do this? I'd argue that from the point of view of the consumer, when a consumer is, or customer, is uh, trying to deal with a brand through social media, they want to believe they're dealing with a brand. It's very much a, we'd like to talk to the organ grinder and not the monkey type attitude. When dealing with professional journalists and professional bloggers, they understand the deal. They understand that uh, yeah, a PR agency is able um, and can legitimately speak on behalf of, of the client. And they understand that that's the relationship they have. Uh, when dealing with a sort of a much more amateur uh, audience, that's just not the case. So one of our most successful clients, uh, Spinvox, has employed a, a social media manager to great effect. And he, um, I think, probably is the best example of, of, of how to do this well that, that I've seen in the UK. He keeps an ear out for people talking about his brand and he engages with them and he is already and most of the channels certainly sort of you know on blogs and, and, and on Twitter recognized as the go-to person for the web uh, other examples of this Comcast who are um, a big and s quite besieged telecoms and triple play operator in the US they're unpopular generally speaking because in the States, you have very little choice over who becomes your, uh, your, your uh, telecoms and, um, and your, your, rather your, your, your video um, and television provider. And as a result, get a certain amount or quite a lot of negative um, comments online. It hasn't been made any better by slightly poor customer service and uh, by the fact that their engineers get videoed um, falling asleep on sofas and turning up on the front page of Google every time you search on the word Comcast. So their customer service division has actually got somebody sitting there looking out on Twitter and on the rest of the web for negative mentions of Comcast and trying quickly to deal with them. Um, this works right now really well because people are still uh, fairly genuine and uh, honest on places like Twitter, but I can see a time very quickly when people will automatically go to uh, Twitter to make their complaints and expect to find it picked up. So I think that in the short term, clients should work with their PR agencies to identify the problems and start putting measures into place to deal with this. I think very quickly they should move to having somebody in-house whose express job it is to do this. And over the medium to long term, they should train up all of their staff to deal with this, because this isn't the job for just a special guy. Um, it's, a, it's a job for every single person in the company to begin to get a sense of how they're doing it. Customer services should be answering customer services questions online. It's, it's, not a, uh, it's not a specialist thing. It's not very hard to do. There are millions of people setting up blogs on Twitter, on Facebook, who have no professional training. Yeah, how much better somebody could do with a little bit of training?